Let's begin with the end in mind. What is your end goal for your child? Is your goal to have straight A's on their transcript, earn a full scholarship to college, protect them from any pain or failure, have fun? While these are all great goals for our kids, they shouldn't be our end goal. What we ultimately want for our kids is for them to be capable, competent, healthy, resilient, independent, hardworking, problem solving, critical thinkers, and productive adults who contribute to the world around them, right? In an article published by the World Economic Forum on the top 10 job skills of 2025, only two of the 10 skills are related to technology. The other eight are related to problem solving, people skills, and self-management. Wow, it's a little shocking, right? Here are some of the specific skills mentioned. Resilience, stress tolerance, flexibility, reasoning, complex problem solving, critical thinking, and analysis. So our kids will learn some of these skills in the process of working towards straight A's or an academic scholarship. But let's be honest, the real classroom for learning these kinds of skills is in the way our kids learn to make decisions for themselves, work through their problems, and handle disappointment and failure. This needs to be our focus as parents. One story my husband and I often think back on is when one of our daughters was banging on the bathroom wall from the inside of the shower, shouting at the top of her lungs, will someone bring me a towel? This was not the first time this had happened. This was a recurring story. She often forgot to bring her towel because it was wet and wadded up in the corner of her bedroom. Usually, someone would jump up and bring her a towel. I mean, what else would we do? until one day we decided not to bring her a towel. In the most loving way possible, we told her she would need to get her own towel. She was not happy with this new solution to her problem, but guess what? She never forgot her towel again, at least that we can remember. We don't want our kids to suffer. We don't want them to be uncomfortable, but when we consider the character traits we want our kids to develop in the end, we may be willing to let them be uncomfortable for now. Maybe, just maybe, they should get their own towel.